Hi, the next topic is box plot. Box plot is often used to see the overall tendency of group. One example uh, like this. So we compare three groups by for some variable. And you can immediately see there um, these three groups are different in terms of this y value. And we have actually the same scale for all box plot. So we can see well, this group has on average the larger y value than this group or this group. So this box represents the first quartile, um, median, and the third quartile. So that means that this box basically includes the 50% of the entire data in this group. So this is median, this is first quartile, 25th percentile, and this is the 75th percentile. Yeah, and uh, so this is called whisker. So whisker is usually the drawn by multiplying the 1.5 by the, this bin width, in this case, we bin height. Okay, so this is 1.5 times, and this is 1.5 times below. But this, this one, so this, uh, this is called whisker, but the end of the whisker is, should be observations. So if no observations at the 1.5 times this, the height of the box, then this whisker can be a little shorter. And why we use 1.5 times? Actually, no theoretical reason, but the, roughly speaking, some you know, larger observations or smaller observations are here. And most observations are within this the whisker. And this plot, this uh, point is an outlier. So actually even you know, below this 1.5 times that this been with us, but still that we have one observation. Sometimes we have multiple observations here. So these are outliers. Actually the first group and the second group don't have any outliers. Okay, so think about this data set, the iris data set. The, this is a famous one. So this data set iris shows the four variables for three species of iris. So three species are setosa, versicolor, and virginica and 50 observations each. And sepal lengths, sepal widths, petal lengths, and petal widths are available for these, um, for these three species. Okay, so to make a box plot, okay, so we have now iris data, so we have attach iris, okay, but the just, uh, I wanna see the, this, so the, species, we want to make box plot by species. For example, we want to make the box plot of sepal lengths by species, then you can type sepal lengths tilde species, sepal lengths. Then we can make this one. And to put the uh, bin in a separate window of separate pane, then um, we have another code, but usually this is most convenient way to compare the three groups, so this. So this is how the box plot works. Uh, we have several different the codes, slightly different codes in a lecture note, but basically this is how to make box plot. Okay, so for example, that to generate this one, you can just define the three different variables and you can put the three box plots. And the specif by specifying the, this multiple figures in row by row function, you can put these three figures in one window. 